Hi, everyone. Welcome to our dinosaur program. How much do you know about dinosaurs? Are you a dinosaur expert? Maybe you visited a museum and you've seen real dinosaur fossils. Maybe you have learned about dinosaurs at school. Maybe you have read a book about dinosaurs. Maybe you have seen a movie about dinosaurs. Maybe you are just a dinosaur fan. Awesome. Do you have a favorite dinosaur? Try to make a list of as many dinosaurs as you can. Here are just a few. Tyrannosaurus, Triceratops, Apatosaurus, Brachiosaurus, and many, many more. How many different kinds of dinosaurs could you name? That's great. You know a lot about dinosaurs. Now let's make some dinosaur crafts. First, we'll make a dinosaur paper bag puppet. Think about what kind of dinosaur you want your dinosaur puppet to be. Take a paper lunch bag and turn it upside down so that the part of the bag with the flap that unfolds is at the top and the opening of the paper bag is at the bottom. Cut out arms and legs and a nose for your dinosaur. Glue the nose over the bottom part of the bag where it unfolds. Glue the arms onto the sides of the bag. Glue the legs onto the bottom of the bag near the opening. Don't forget to make some dinosaur eyes. and add some great big dinosaur teeth. I'm going to use some washable paint and a round sponge brush to add some dots to my dinosaur. Decorate the dinosaur, and when it is dry, you can have a dinosaur puppet show. Next, we are going to make a paper plate dinosaur. Cut a paper plate in half. This will be the dinosaur's body. Using some construction paper, create a head, neck, and tail for your dinosaur. Using paints or markers, color the paper plate to make it look like whichever kind of dinosaur you'd like. Using washable paint and a small piece of bubble wrap, you can add some texture to the dinosaur's body that look like scales. Cut off two small pieces of a cardboard tube as well. These will be the dinosaur's legs. Decorate them first, and then make two small cuts on the top of each tube. This will make an opening where your paper plate can sit in the tops of the tubes. When you have all the parts of your dinosaur ready, put it together. It will stand on its own, just like a real dinosaur. You can also make a clothespin dinosaur puppet. On construction paper, draw the face of your favorite dinosaur. This one is going to be a Tyrannosaurus. You can also draw legs or arms for your dinosaur. Draw as much as you'd like. Then cut out the dinosaur. Cut the top part with the dinosaur's top jaw as one piece, and the bottom part with the dinosaur's bottom jaw and arms or legs as another piece. Take the top jaw piece and glue it to one side of the clothespin opening. Take the bottom jaw or body of the dinosaur and glue it to the other side of the clothespin opening. Now when you open the clothespin, it looks like your dinosaur's mouth is actually moving. So cool. Last, we'll be making a hand print dinosaur. This one is going to be a triceratops. 
They have three horns on their head. Trace your hands on a piece of construction paper. Then cut out the tracing. Next, cut a small piece of construction paper for the nose. You'll need to cut out three triangles for the dinosaur's three horns. Don't forget to make eyes for the dinosaur too. Glue all of your pieces onto the hand shape. And wow, you have a cool dinosaur. You can make any of these crafts to look like any kind of dinosaur. Using a little creativity and a lot of imagination, you could create some very cool dinosaur friends. Don't forget to read some fun stories about dinosaurs too. Visit the library and the library website for some good ideas. Well, dinosaur fans, thanks for joining us today. See you next time.